Hi there Platinum Traders and welcome to today's Trade of the Day video. My name's Aaron Upple, I'm one of the senior traders here at Platinum Trading Academy and I'm here to take you through today's video. Now in today's video we are going to be discussing a few different strategies that have been used, three in total actually. We've had uh, day trading strategies, we've had extreme zone strategies and we've had longer term breakout strategies so um, you know, bear with me I will try and get through everything as quickly as I can and not take up too much of your time in this video. So to get things started as all of you know uh, or should know if you, or, or if you are new to the videos you'll know that we provide one to one mentoring um, every single day every single week with our clients and we also provide them with professional analysis that they can use to trade the markets each and every day. I'm going to show you this analysis first to give you an understanding of how it's presented and where the information comes from. So this is going to take you to our members area just here. So in our members area, as you can see, if I scroll on up here, March 8th for today, you've then got our daily chart analysis as we scroll down, which is giving you different information on each chart, technical analysis. You've got then your platinum methodology section coming on through here which is again then giving you extra information uh, and rules and tips and pointers on how to interpret the analysis. You've then got your fundamental view which of course is extremely important in the market having an understanding of economic events and what are occurring from day to day and week to week. And then we have our sort of individual currency pairs, uh, sort of weekly analysis, longer term analysis and daily updates. So. Obviously the day trades, I'm going to take you to the algorithm to show you those. Uh, we've had, I believe, one on the euro, two on the pound. Uh, so I'm going to show you those day trades first, then I'm going to show you the extreme zone as well, and then the longer term trade on the Aussie. So the day trades that occurred on the euro was on Monday. You can see here, um, if, you, if you're new to these videos, you'll see that we have buy and sell zones which are set every single day. Um, those are done right at the beginning of the morning before most people are awake. What we then do in the morning is we label the zones that we believe should have the most high probability of reversing for that day. And we label these zones either important trading zone or major cap. So we can see here that we've labeled this major cap on Monday. It's triggered in later in the day and it's reversed. Um, we usually have around 20 to 25 pip stops on these and the same for the profits. So in regards to that particular trade, it'd be a, a minimum of 20 to 25 pips profit taken on just a simple pending order at the start of the day. Then we have the pound trades. Again, similar scenario. We've labeled these again. You can see on Tuesday, we labeled this zone here at 31.05. The buy zone, you can see again, it's reversed quite easily in excess of 20 pips there. And again, we've had at 3100 the buy zone, it's reversed in excess of the 20 to 25 pips. So just from those three day trades, you could have bagged yourself uh, basically up to 75 pips profit just on those three. And you would have just been placing orders at the start of the day. You would not have to be there to place the trade. Then we had the extreme zone. Again, anyone who's not watched the video, these extreme zones are pretty much used in high volatile markets. Um, they are fantastic trades and we look to pretty much take around 30 to 50 pips profit from these particular zones. Um, so if we're looking at this one here, you can pretty much take your profit right now if you're a client that's in this trade and watching this video. Um, you know, you, you're taking out there at least 40 pips profit from, again, it's just a simple order that you could have placed or even if you were there, you could have just simply taken it. Okay, So we're already racking up the pips here. We're talking about 120 pips already just on those four trades. Then, going back to the trading floor, I'm going to take you to the Australian dollar chart. Now, if we go to the Aussie dollar chart and we, we look on the chart here, what we had is we had a descending triangle and we were looking for a breakout of the triangle. So you can see here, BPC opportunity would daily close below 70.50 to target next support level of 69.90. Now, in the end, it's come down to 7,000, where many clients took profit for around 50 pips or so. I actually want to show you a screenshot of the trade that was taken as well on this trade. So we can see in here, this was a short scenario that was actually taken. Uh, we took a screenshot of the actual trade uh, to show you it being taken as well. So you can sort of see that, you know, that was actually taken by some of the traders here. Um, so 
Show you you on the live chart. We go to the Aussie here. Uh, let's go to the Aussie. Where are we? Aussie daily. You can see coming on through. You can see you had the breakout of the Fib level coming on through here. We had the pullback the previous day, and obviously it then continued on going down. So in terms of the number of pips produced here, we're talking about 170 pips this week in five trades. Okay. So just to repeat that, 170 pips in five trades. So if you want to have some access to this, we're actually providing it on our website. As you can see, platinumtradingacademy.com. Pop your details on the homepage just here, book consultation. One of our traders will get in touch with you and they'll book that in for you to get you access to the trading algorithm, to the trading analysis and to speak to a trader all at the same time. Just want to say, look, thank you very much for watching today's video. Really appreciate that. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll speak to you all next week. Thank you.